Hey there, you filthy animals. Mr. Dirty back with another episode of the GTM Show. And today we're checking out something new from Publix. I don't think we've ever had Publix on the show before. It's a grocery store. Uh, a lot of people talk big about their subs. Me in particular, I don't think their subs are all that they're cracked up to be. You probably get a better sub from Jersey Mike's. But in the deli, right where they make the subs, same station and everything, they've got flatbread pizza out now. Got three different kinds, and only two of them really am I interested in. Got one of them here today, and the other one is a spinach and artichoke chicken pizza. This one's going to be the buffalo chicken pizza. So, it comes in a flat box like this, completely flat. Our flatbread is in here, and they completely construct the entire thing in this box. Uh, I started to watch them begin to make it, and then I got preoccupied by some other stuff I saw around the deli area. But, um, yeah, they begin with this, they start to construct it, and they shove this entire box into the convection oven. I guess it can handle the, uh, the heat. And, yeah, everything is done right in here. Let's crack this open and see our buffalo chicken flatbread pizza from the Publix Deli. And there you go, okay? There's your buffalo chicken flatbread pizza. Uh, the darker spots that you see there, that is blue cheese. Uh, I think there might be some other kind of cheese on here. We do have chicken. Uh, we left off the green onions. And then there's hot sauce on there. So there you go. Take all that in. Let's see, we'll probably bring you in and get a closer look. The surface of our flatbread pizza there. Yeah, it does smell kind of surly. Uh, the buffalo chicken that they went with here, it seems to be the buffalo chicken that they sell that you can like spread on bread right there in the deli. It comes in a container. You can usually buy it in like, um, it looks like pints and quarts maybe. And they just kind of spoon it onto the flatbread. Then they top it with little balls of the blue cheese. Shove it in the convection oven. And it appears that they have kind of lightly sliced this into triangles. I don't think you can see that on there, but we should be able to just crack off a piece here. There we go. And there's a closer look there. It doesn't look too bad. Let's say it does have that surly scent. It's our, uh, you know, the chicken spread and the blue cheese all coming together there. As I'm checking this out here, it appears that there's like slabs of mozzarella cheese on there also. Just gonna fold this up like this and give it a good chomp. Here we go. The uh, buffalo chicken flatbread pizza from the Publix Deli. Um, it's extremely salty. I'll start with that very salty. It does taste like chicken, like canned chicken. Uh, the blue cheese, I'm not getting the full effect of the blue cheese. I don't know what it is. And they were using fresh blue cheese too. They had like a big block of it. And they were grabbing chunks of it off and crumbling it onto here. But it really should have more of a sting, more of a bite. Yeah, the whole thing when it comes together between that buffalo chicken spread and the blue cheese, it, it's really fighting each other. It, it's coming across as extremely exotic flavored. It's not lending itself to either or. It's kind of coming across as something new. It's stinky and surly, and I kind of like it. You snap off another triangle here. Give this one more go. All right, on the back end of that second piece there, I start to get more of the blue cheese effect. A little stronger flavor there. Yeah, it's definitely in the clumps here, where you get the full effect of the flavor. I also did get a little bit of the hot sauce there. So yeah, it's kind of hit and miss as it's clumped on there. It's not exactly an even spread by any means. So just keep that in mind when you go into this. You know, they put crumbles of this stuff on there. So the strength of the flavor, it's going to come in like waves, depending on, you know, what you've bitten here. Overall, not bad. Um, it's stinky. Stinky in a good way. I could probably see myself buying this again. Uh, the price point that we bought this at was, um, let's see, six bucks right there, $5.99. And as you can also see on there, back in stores is the uh, Ruffle All Dress Chips. But back to this, I definitely see myself picking this up again. I'm going to give this a solid four out of five. Alright, so there you have what they're calling the uh, Buffalo chicken flatbread pizza, new in the deli of Publix grocery stores. Give it a go. 
I'm Mr. Dirty, this is the GTM Show. You can buy knucklehead t-shirts and hoodies down in the description. And follow me on Instagram and Twitter at the real Mr. Dirty. And as always, get out of here, go have a rotten day.